In this tutorial we're going to calculate sizes using magnifications. So here's a typical GCSE question. We're told that hair X is 20 micrometers wide. So that hair has a width of 20 micrometers. Shiv examines hair X using a total magnification of times 150. How wide will the hair appear under the microscope in micrometers. So we want to find out what it actually appears. Its actual size is 20 micrometers. But we're going to magnify that by 150 times so it's going to appear much bigger than that. So 20 multiplied by 150 will give us 3000 micrometers. Now the question doesn't ask us this but an extra challenge would be to convert our answer in micrometers to millimeters. Now we know there's 1000 micrometers in a millimeter. So all we need to do is to divide micrometers by a thousand. So 3000 divided by a thousand is going to give you three millimeters. So that's how big the hair appears. OK, one final question. Use your magnification to work out how wide the adult water flea's body is. Show you working. So we've got a picture here of our water flea. We're also told that it's been magnified a hundred times. So this is what it appears. If I was to measure that using a ruler, of course, let's just say it measures 40 millimetres, 4 centimetres, 40 millimetres. Now this water flea appears 40, milli, 40 millimetres wide because it's been magnified a hundred times. So to find out that width for real, the actual width, we're going to divide it by 100. So 40 divided by 100, we move that decimal point a couple of places to the left. So it's going to actually be 0 0.4 millimetres wide. Again, for a bit of extra challenge, if we are to convert millimetres into micrometres, what would that be? So 0.4 millimetres in micrometres, we need to multiply it a thousand times. So it's going to appear to be 400, it's actually going to be rather, it's actually going to be 400 micrometres wide. It's worth you having a look at this video a couple of times just to really um, get to grips with these questions and maybe you could design some questions yourself.